divas i just wanted to show you uh, a bunch of the fun accessories that you could do with your happy planner these are a couple i'm not sure which ones i'm using for this year and which ones i'm not but um i just want to show you some of the fun things and i've um had a collection over the years um but first uh these come in either singly or um in one of the fun packs a couple of the fun packs that have them they are a belly band that go around a classic planner to keep them tight and they have a pen loop you may have seen in another video they have a pen loop on them um, that you can use this mermaid one i don't think was a happy planner uh, special but uh it's the same thing the belly band this is like a fuzzy like a velour type of fuzziness and it goes around your classic size planner for fun. Also, they have what they call um, punch, a weekly box punch. If you have the vertical planner, it fits perfectly if you punch out a picture or uh, other scrapbook paper or something else to go in that area. It's a 1.5 by 2.4 inch classic punch. They have one for the big as well, I believe but that's fun they have lots of different discs you see on the edges of the happy planners it is a disc bound system and sometimes you need bigger discs and they call them expander discs they're very large they are let's see to compare the two they are okay this size to this size can you see the difference in that um you can get like two planners together on an expander disc if you need to they come in metal they come in plastic they come in rainbow they come in solid colors um so they come in all different variations this one's a rose gold expander discs so they have silver and gold and rose gold and i'm not sure if they have and I'm sure they have expanded discs in some of the other colors, but they have a great many colors. And usually at the end of a season, when they're ready to come out with new stuff, they put all this stuff on sale. You can get them at Michael's, you can get them at Joann's, you can get them at Hobby Lobby, and you can get them from their website. All right, they also have, let me move this over. They also have their own washi tapes that go along with their their um uh collection each one each happy planner has a theme a color theme and these go with the color themes this one was let's see from 2016 okay it's an old one um sometimes when you get the the kits like if you buy a happy planner bag or box they might include some of the old things in there this one was a 2022 this was a brand new this year beautiful beautiful colors this was a 2015 so you know they've been doing it a long time i've been using happy planners for that long for 2015 2016 um right after they first came out uh i i just i just love them so anyway they have a lot of fun colors of washi tapes that match they have different uh, widths. They have the super skinny, and they have the uh, the regular. What are they? Three, fifteen millimeter, ten millimeter, six millimeter, in there. And I think there's even one not in their packet, but there's even one that's even skinnier uh, than six millimeter. I think there's a three, and I like them in between things too. Let's see. Okay, let's put those away. Next. Uh, there are pouches that pencil pouches that you can get that go in that they go either in the planner or alongside of a planner but let's see all right this is a different these were not a happy planner brand they're g2 metallic g2 the 0.7 in a metallic is really nice. Anyway, they'll fit perfectly in here. Even some of your markers will fit in there very well. 
that's one way of um, you can collect a few pens or alcohol markers or or um, uh, mild liners to to use within your planners and you can put them in a fancy pocket the other some of the pockets come with the holes in them already that you can click them right into the spine of your happy planner they come in all different shapes and sizes you can always find these when on clearance sales as well they're very well made i have never had these things break off of the end and this is another little like a coin purse size that says choose happy these are often in the variety packs the ex accessory extension packs that you can get that's a fun accessory you can you can use <clears throat> another fun accessory is they had these in different colors it's called snap-in hardcover i am going to be using this for a change this came in one of their <clears throat> happy um their happy bags happy planner accessory bags they, they do that when they want to clearance some stuff out that they've got stock um, they put a few new things and a lot of old things in it but i love these i've always wanted these and I have never gotten them. So these are a hard board cover that goes on the outside. Um, a different type of cover that you can get is called the deluxe cover. There you, can, you can see that I've used this one a bit. It's kind of scuffed up. It has, sometimes it has writing on it when gold foil, sometimes it doesn't. And they have a folder in here they have a couple pockets and on the back they have a pen loop can you see that they have a pen loop and another pocket and you slip your planner right in there okay this was the faith planner i have to take this out because i'm not going to use it in here i need to remove these accessories and see what I'm going to do with them but this was an older faith planner and you can always you can change them out you can do so many different neat things with it uh, another type of accessory is their bags now i hope you can see this this is their soft sided bag it has a zipper pocket on the outside okay it has like a, um, a water bottle pocket on each side. It's got two pockets on the outside, perfect to put one of their bigger sticker books in. You want me to measure it? I can measure it for you. The sides are 16 inches high by, from seam to seam, it is 16 inches wide so this one's a square it has nice stiff handles it's waterproof on the inside i'm getting there on the inside you have something that goes in the bottom to just straighten it out to make it flat put that in the bottom to make the bottom flat so it squares off for you okay good and it goes underneath the center zipper pocket. The zipper pocket does not go all the way to the bottom. It's like more free formed. It's, it goes all the way to the bottom, but it's not attached at the bottom. That's what I want to say. Big full zipper pocket. On this side, you have an open pocket that you can put um, something in to grab quick. Put your wallet in there, your cell phone, whatever you need to in there. And it's got Workaholic. Um, this is from the Workaholic series. The Work and Life. What am I saying? Workaholic. This is from the Work and Life series of Happy Planner. It's And it's got a nice big snap. To hold everything in. Okay. Another from the Work and Life group. It's got a tote bag that is a hard tote bag hard square it's got nothing on the outside but it's got the um like i said i've been using this to uh, 
It's got the faux leather uh, bottoms, the scuff resistant. It says the Happy Planner embossed in there, but it's you don't you can't read it. So it is 15 wide by by nine and a half deep uh, tall by six deep. Okay, six deep that way, six deep that way. So, and in the inside, you have two nice handles. They're not shoulder handles, but they're like carry handles. You have a divider, a couple dividers that are Velcroed in. You see the Velcro in there? That's one. Then you have a small divider that's Velcroed to that one and to the side. And a large one that's Velcroed to the side and to the center board. So you can have two sections. Different planners can go in here. A sticker book can go in this side. That's how wide it is. One of the pencil pouches can go in here. You can organize your life as maybe a work planner or a notebook. Um, you can do two different school, um, two different school notebooks. You can organize it any way you want to. You can have all your planners for the year in it if you'd like. And they have some really fun ones too that come with their special series. Now, let me get into that. Come here. It's getting caught. Okay. <laughs> this was a tote bag that came with one of their, their, um, you know, uh, happy planner accessory kits. Plans are dreams in the making. Okay. This one, I don't think you can get this outside of that kit, but it is, let's see, from seam to seam. It is 14 and a half wide. I'm just going the length of the, the boxy seam at the bottom to the top. 16 high and it's got a boxed out seam so you can have a bottom that's about three inches okay so the more you fill it up the you know the less wide it'll be but and it's just plain on the inside with webbing um, webbing handles that are sewed in very strongly they're like double double sewn in there very strong and the other one I showed you in another video, it has a tiny little accessory bag, just big enough to put some of the little accessories in. It was real small. So those are some of the, the uh, other things I'm going to be using. In addition to that, they have uh, stickers are a whole nother, a whole nother thing as well. Um, but they have these little accessory packs. This one is, let's see, what do they call this? Household. And this was put out in 2018. Even if you can't get these anymore, the, on the website they have a lot of um, discontinued items that they, they sell on sale. If, even if you can't get this exact one, each year they come out with some kind of variation of it. So if it's not this one in particular, it will be a variation. Okay, so you have... You have a bunch of stickers that pertain to that type of planner. Some have a clear background. Some are more a matte finish, so you can write on top of them. Okay. Uh, yard work, chore checklist. Bless this mess. Amen, amen. Uh, little clean it up stickers. And little food stickers. You can do breakfast, lunch, dinner, breakfast, lunch, dinner. These might be good um, along the planners that have sections, well, like wellness sections, and, and you can label the, the sections per week on them. There's some food things, like when did I eat fast food this week? I'm going to stick a sticker there. <clears throat> Cleaning checklists and more toppers. Cleaning day. How many of them are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 
times 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 45. I know you have 52 weeks, but there are others in here that you can substitute if it's a little different. <clears throat> Yard work, cleaning bucket, daily chores with the grid layout, dollar signs, credit card, electricity. So those are for your budgeting. And ones with the gold foil, grocery list. They just give you ideas. I dusted once and it all came back. Not falling for that again. <laughs> That's my type of cleaning, right? Okay, so then you have these little sticky notes. Um, and if you peel them off from the short side, they don't curl up. Let's see. That's what I've been told. This one says chores to do and checklist for done. Come on now, peel off, please. Now, if you go from the side and peel it that way, it stays rather it's supposed to stay rather flat, <laughs> but again, this is an older one, so I don't know. Anyway, um, this is bill due. You can write the name of the bill in here or the amount and then check paid. Let's eat. Um, what are you eating in there? These are little journal cards that are double-sided that you can just stick in as reminders. Clean it up. Wash it up. Okay, bless this mess. It has a checklist in the back. These are basically like checklists you can, I call them blow-ins, just like the magazine blow-ins, but you can just stick them anywhere in your planner as an instant reminder when you get to that page. <laughs> a clean house is a sign of a wasted life. <laughs> maybe, maybe not. All right. Housework won't kill you, but why take dishes? So this is for those who procrastinate with your... Um, Okay, and this has weekly meals, top chores of the week. There's a few of them that are repeated. Okay. So that is the household, a household pack. They have a bunch of these different uh, accessory stickers, accessory packs in different formats for the different types of planners that you have. <clears throat> Again, that was a household one from 2018. All right. Next, let me see if I have any more of those that I can show you. A different one. Nope. Okay. I don't think so. Yeah, plenty of them. They come in a smaller size too. These are regular. These are all sticky notes. Blah blah blah. To do. Note to self. P.S. One to five. Arrows. Um, just sticky note adhesive pads. This was out in 2016. So I've had it this long and it's still in its wrapper. I haven't used it yet. Um, I don't use sticky notes as much. I really, I really love them, but I don't know why I don't use them as much. Anyway, that's another one. <clears throat> and let's see, they have different types of dividers. You get the dividers and it's envelopes. You get the dividers in these accessory packs, dashboards, and bookmarks these are all for the classic size and they go along with one of their planners so this was a 2022 this was a new one I'll just take another pack i think there's only two in this one two pieces two bookmarks because they're special cuts they go in the bloom planter aren't they beautiful planter planner they're super beautiful. <clears throat> I do plan on using those. All right, let me slide these in here. And what makes them a bookmark is they have the tab at the top. And you can use stickers or you can put um, a little swath of, of rolled on white out and then you can put the name of the section that you want it to bookmark. That's how I deal with those. These two are dashboard, everyday dashboards, and they're also dividers, hard stiff dividers. This one was 2020. They're both from 2020. Okay, I'll show you these two real quick. Here. 
But like I said, they come out with a different set of dashboards every year. <clears throat> they have the three tabs at the top. This is Choose Happy. This one goes with the planner that has this on it. It's not white. It's more clear. The white is there just to show you what it's like. And get lost in what you love. So it goes with those type of planners. You can use it for anything, obviously. And... trickiest part is always getting them back in <laughs> always the trickiest part let me feed these big ones back in here first come on all right don't get caught on the plastic then i'll slide this one in don't get caught on the plastic that's the problem there we go one and two I have ones I bought in other years and used and they are I'll show you how uh, one of the ways that I keep them so I can reuse them in other planners come on now come out here the whole thing come on out here it's just the cardboard Yeah, there are three pieces in here. Fine. You want to do it that way, that's up to you. Okay, this says, embrace your own pace. Just bloom. Look how beautiful they are. If you've seen the other videos I've done, you kind of know which sets they go to. She, she loves the smell of coffee, bloomed roses, and new beginnings. Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. All right, now, this is probably how they go back in easier. <laughs> Far be it for me to do things the easy way. I don't know, maybe you're like that, too. Get in there. All right, another fun accessory that you can get is plastic envelopes. You might have seen some of these in a different video. They're usually three different sizes, but this is all one size. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She leaves a little sparkle wherever she goes. Today looks bright. So these are three. What makes them an envelope? Well, you turn them over, and there you go. They're big enough to put a receipt inside. Or a folded up letter, or, you know, you can put them in your bill section and, and keep some bills in it that you need to remind yourself to to purchase to purchase you need to remind yourself to pay my goodness i'm having such problem with my words here all right come on Okay, another thing you can do is if you want to make your own covers, they have custom cover kits. And basically, this is how you do it. They have the, the rings cut out on one side, and you just slip in whatever um, cut piece of paper you want to put in there. It could be one of their pre-cut um, scrapbook papers. It could be... Uh, anything that you find somewhere that you find inspirational could be one of your own making. But uh, you can put it in double-sided, and there's two of them in each pack. So you have a front cover and a back cover that you can create your own cover with. That's always fun. They have extra folders. Yeah, okay. They have extra folders. I think this is B, the reason someone smiles today. These are pocket folders. There are six pieces in here. This is one of the hippie planner things I loved. 
2021. Okay. That's the year that it was created. It may have come out the year after, but that's the year it was copyrighted. Uh, sometimes they that differs. Like the beginning of the year, like in the spring editions, they're going to be copyright 2022, but it'll be 2023 when they come out. The rest of the year will probably be all copyright 2023. That's how this works. A little bit of tea. Oh, I've been doing so many videos, it's crazy. Okay, be the reason someone smiles today. Radiate positive vibes. I wish I would have gone for that boho one. That just is just so awesome. It is so me. Don't rush the process. Good things take time. Leave in the good. Fall in love with today. Always find a reason to smile. I have a collection of previously used folders as well. They basically, the folders, you can get them in separate packs like this. You can get them within fun accessory kits. There's usually one at the most two in some of the accessory kits that go with the special planners. Come on now. You're not supposed to go in there. Okay. Come on. If I remember right, some of these folders came with the original, the very first planners. Okay, now these are some of the... Oh, I want to show you this first, and then I'll show you these. These are... came out this year, 2022. And what they are, are for the sewing, the for Joann's, special for Happy Sewing Collection. They are templates designed for your disc bound system. Here we go. If you are a sewer, or, and I say also dieter, <laughs> if you are a sewer, these are good for that. So if you want to make your own um, tracker, you can use the squared off ones. These are for checklists. This is like a fake stitching line, fake stitching lines, and some flags at the bottom. They're good for every tracker. This one is what we call a croaky, and it's the way you measure, um, you measure your body. And this one I can, you can use as a dieting aid too. You can, uh, dieting, you know, uh, a fitness wellness aid. You can write in your measurements at the beginning and then at the end after you and put the pounds in somewhere. But again, this has more of the stitches that are you're able to like put fake around your pages if you want to look at like that. These are arrows you find on pattern pieces and notches that you find on pattern pieces. And these would be for checklists. And on a different one, you have the explanation of that pretty much. These are the names of each of the measurements and what they're called. And you can write your own, in a dry erase marker, you can write, write your own measurements on here. This goes with the current year's So Happy Planner. S-E-W, So Happy. All right. Which I do have, and I'm planning on using that this year as well. Come here. Come here, come here, come here. All right, all right. And like the reason why I'm showing you some of these, even if they're out of date, is because each year they come out with similar lines that match the new planners for the year. So it may not be exactly the same as these, but you will find similar pieces. Oh, come on. Sometimes getting the back in the envelope is the most frustrating thing in the world. But I like to keep them that way until I use them. <laughs> All right. 
the fun accessory kits. You can get fun accessory kits too that go with some of the planners. Oh, I'm sorry. This is a park lane. I can't show you that one. <laughs> Cut that out. Cut that out. Cut that out. I can show it to you, but not as a happy planner. <laughs> okay. I want to show you this one. This one is a typical happy planner accessory kit. All right. In one of the everyday styles. It'll have some note paper. It'll have some stickers that go with that style. It'll have a small little tab, like a dashboard tab, that has two sticky notes in it. It will have a divider, a bookmark, and a folder. And let's see what this one has. This one came out in 2020. And it goes with that specific notebook. Or I should it went with that specific notebook. I love the colors. I get things for the colors and then I hope to use everything. Okay, so there's this plastic piece of yuts in here that attempts to hold everything in place. Chuck it. All right, this bookmark is says, Get Lost in What You Love. And these are the two sticky tabs that you can use on your thing. It has one sticker sheet. And they used to give two out, so they're getting a little less, you know. Beautiful day begins with a beautiful mindset. The world needs who you were made to be. Live life in color choose happy look on the bright side take note and all that that kind of good stuff to go with it this is the folder keep it all together that's appropriate and after you use these for a while um they used to be out of paper this is more of a plasticine plasticized paper but they used to pull out easily and i have a way to fix those and I'll show you that in a different video. Okay, and here are some of the take note pages. Um, did it say how many they gave you? 20, 20 sticky notes. Uh, it just says pre punched paper. It doesn't say how many. I don't really want to count them, but one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. So I guess it is twenty pieces of paper. It just says take note on one side, and both sides are exactly the same. Okay. So that is an accessory pack. Sometimes they come with a little pouch. Sometimes they come with a little bracelet. Sometimes they come with a whole bunch of different things in it. But often at the end of the season, sometimes they have some of these extra. Sometimes they don't. Sometimes they go really quickly. So I don't like to take a chance. I like to jump on it fairly quickly if I'm going to get one. If I love it, I jump on it. All right, let's get this in here the right way. Oh, they slide in a lot better that way. <coughs> Joann's is also coming out with their own line of ring bound system. I just found this out for this year. Uh, this does not have a copyright date on it that I can see. Made especially for Joann's stores. It is the Park Lane accessory kit, 63 different accessories. It says two sticky notepads, one bookmark, eight sticker sheets, one list pad, 20 note paper sheets, three dividers, two paper pockets, 18 die cut tabs, six paper clips, one canvas pouch, and one paper folder. Let's take a look at this Park Lane. And they have different styles as well. Here are the cute little paper clips. They adorable. Okay, this is the to-do list pad. That's cool. Oh, isn't this a neat little bookmark? 
it's got um, dangles on it and it just clicks through the first three uh, the first three pieces. That's interesting. Here is the sticky pads. Very neutral. This one has a like a piece of the dashboard plastic cut off, but that's alright. It doesn't matter. Let's look at the sticker sheets. Gold foil. Lots of gold foil. Like kind of muddy to-dos. Oh, that's pretty. Black and white flowers. You can probably color them. They're in a mat. Yeah, I don't know if I like the font. The foil is kind of muddied. Kind of like bleeding over. These are beautiful. Enjoy the little things. See the beauty. Good things take time. Different. Uh, and these are like washi tapes. Or strips like washi tapes. And you have an alphabet. That's nice. Alphanumerics. Aha. Uh -huh. I see this one comes with a zipper pouch. It's not plastic on the inside. It's just cloth. But it's plenty of room to put your, your uh, pencils and things in. These. Oh, this is cool. This is a... Uh, unfolded folder with a pocket on one side and a different type of pocket on the other. Very cool. This is a paper folder. It's not stiff in any kind. It looks like there is the pockets are only on the one side of the paper. Okay, that's what the other side looks like. Different pattern. And that pattern is folded over. That's cool. And here's some extra dividers. There are three dividers in here that go with their pattern. You can use any paper you want in them and uh, punch out your own folds if you'd like. I'll put these in backwards. I did. And here are the tabs. Okay, that you write on it and you fold it and there's a sticker strip on this side now I'm going to lose that one aren't I <laughs> uh, I might as well just put it in with the little doodads there and this just, just says notes pre-punched pages that say notes on it very neutral color very professionally done I like these kits I would get them as accessories kits they, they have the same hole punch as the happy planner kits so you can use them in conjunction with what you already have okay and that's park lane park lane accessory kit okay other accessory kits uh, this one is 12 month undated calendar extension. Now, are all the rest of these calendar extensions? No. I have another planner companion pack from Happy Planner. Let me do this one first. <clears throat> this was their Miss Maker series from 2021. Miss Maker. Okay. And that's their creative. Uh, the creative line. All right, a little, a little pouch to go with it. Living that DIY life, and it's an open folder. I use these. I have a special hack for using these in your planner as well. The outside cover. All right, you get. Let's see, three envelopes. Again, they're the plastic envelopes that have the flap. Maker's gonna make. <laughs> I waited a long time to get this one. I wasn't coming in, wasn't coming in, wasn't coming in. All right, this has two different types of paper, crafty ideas. And the one in the back is just like that. Uh, there's an extra pack 
of pages that you can get. One, two, three, supply list, make all the things. And you see this in the um, the happy the Miss Maker Happy Planner. I think they might even have in their so happy line. They might also have that. Come on. All right, let me get these goodies back in here. Then on this side you have two sheets of stickers. See, there used to be two sheets of stickers. This one has foil. It's a little off center, but it's kind of homey that way. And this one is the matte finish. You have a dashboard divider, a wipe erase dashboard. Okay. And you have what they call uh, vision boards. Create what you love. Crafting is always a good idea. I just want to make things, pretty things. Making all the things. So if you have some goals for the year, a vision board for maybe uh, if you're building a she shed or your own craft room and things you want to do to put in your new craft room, you can put them in it. Create what you love is the plasticized the hard cardboard folder. So that is the Miss Maker accessory pack from 2021. Again, it's different depending, you have different ones, different years, depending on what types of planners they come out with during the year. And they can be used and reused no matter what type of planning system that you have. You may just need an accessory pack and not buy the whole planner. Okay, these are undated extension packs. The Sunshine one was put out in 2019. These are this year's undated calendar extension pack, 2022. Okay, they go with the So Happy, Happy Sewing line. So this is what a normal extension, normal, this is what a vertical extension pack would look like. It's good for six months usually. Oh, I'm sorry. This is a 12 monthly calendar pages. Usually they have six and then you have to buy two of them. <sighs> Probably changed that over the years too. All right. With your extension pack, you get... Um, you get the months, you get the months that go along the tabs, the months that go on the top of the calendar pages, you get one to 30, many different times, 12 different times, and you have special days, stickers. In each one, you get a 12 of these tw travel, the this is unusual. These are only the months. So basically, there is no decoration on the inner ones. It's just the other month. If you wanted to go month to month on their own, on their own, they come in different colors. They start with Sunday and end with Saturday. That's the way their regular monthly pages go. And that's it. That's all that's in this extension kit, I believe. See if I used anything out of it. Um, 12 month undated extension should come with 440 stickers. We saw that. One note paper. I didn't see that. Maybe that's on the back. Yeah, that's the very last thing. A cover and the monthly yeah the monthly uh tabs that's cool this is the bare minimum you need in a planner the bare minimum come on so you would date each of the days in there and put the month on it but it gives you the flexibility you can start at whatever 
time of the of the year you want. You can start in February. You can start in July. You can start whenever you want. That's flexibility for that. The next, and these are two of the same. They're from the Happy Sewing Collection Calendar Extension for this year, 2022. It has stickers, storage folder, undated monthly and weekly calendar pages, monthly prompts to focus your month, space for creative planning and scheduling. Okay. Ah, ha, ha, ha. It's the dashboard layout. That's why they can do that. All right. Pull one out. Let me show you. The, um, pull the whole thing out. All right. These are, let's see, there's four. <laughs> this is per quarter. As so much in it, it's per quarter, not by year. Money can't buy happiness, but it can buy sewing supplies, and that's pretty close. Or crafting supplies. So these are um, four tabs that are like the ones in the current sewing planner. Busy hands, happy heart. Okay. And you get the month. The full month right after each one and then since this is a dashboard layout which means the focus on block it's got different you can rename them any way you want but there's a two different types of checklists there's the dot the uh, graph paper and then the line this goes Monday to Sunday Monday to Sunday you have the weekend of the one thing and there should be five of these in each month and on the back of the month, it can be a currently what you want to do for the coming month or um, priorities that you want to remember. So it's got those in each of those three sections, four sections. So you need three of these packs in order to make a complete year if you wanted it completely undated. Sometimes you just want a couple to get you through to the next year. This is a beautiful folder. Beautiful things come together one stitch at a time. Oh, I love that. And these are your dated. You can use the fun uh, monthly for the top of the month. These for each of the individual days of the month. For the three months. You get all the months there because they don't know which one you're going to use. And you get <clears throat> another sticker sheet fun stuff in it. So that is this um, extension pack. All right, there's one other type of fun thing I want to show you in this video. I have to get off to work soon, but I want to show you one more thing. <clears throat> like I said, stickers will be a whole different, um, will be a whole different video. Faith planning, a whole different video. Budget planning, a whole different video. Wellness, journaling, there'll be different videos. Um, and my Franklin Planner catch-all will be a different video. All those things will be different. So I have many more videos to come. Um, and special art journaling and journaling ones will be different as well. All right, this is what is called an everyday everyday paper sheet. There are 40 sheets in here. And these come, this was from 2020. But again, they come in different styles during the year. They kind of blend with some of the, the uh, planners that go with that year. And I'm having trouble bringing them out here. I'll do the thing at once here. Okay. So there are 40 of these same pages. It says today, check it off, important. And the back, you have a dot grid. Do all these things. Do all the things. So you can do whatever you want with the back. You can do your your um, bullet journaling ideas in there and all different kinds of things. And this can keep you on track. Uh, there's 40 of them. Even though you have 52 weeks, you might want to use one a week. You might want to use it and uh, fold it in half so that 
well, nearly in half anyway, to the rings so that you have the important checklist on that side and you have the grid on the back. And that way, if you put it in the middle of your week, you can still see the whole week together. I like to do that with some of these pages. All right, that's it for some of the fancy accessories that you can get with your Happy Planner set. Uh, like I said, the, the, um, the ideas are endless. You can do, if you can't find what you want in this planner system, you haven't looked hard enough. <laughs> Um, look on the resale sites for older for older uh, planners, older styles. If you don't see what you like in the current years, there's plenty available. Uh, people are destocking their extras that may have gotten a paper pack and didn't use all of it or didn't use it at all that are destashing it. So I encourage you to look into those as well. All right, thank you for joining me for Wanda's Work Basket for all things creative and crafty with a little bit of inspiration mixed in. Don't forget to like and subscribe and click the little bell. Lots of things are going on in the planner world, in the diamond painting world, in the art journaling and, and um, uh, other journaling, uh, wellness journaling era. And I have a lot more to show you uh, in all those different types. So... Um, Stick around. You may find something you like. <laughs> Bye, divas.